So welcome to my channel and let's talk about my December coloring plans. Honestly, never ever I had started my December in such mood without any festive Christmas feeling and without much inspiration to create something, stitching or coloring also. But I decided that if I create for myself huge coloring plans, if I put near me a lot of beautiful books, maybe my inspiration, it will return. So what I intend to color in December? First of all, I need to finish my huge project, which I started in November, in Mythic Vault, as you can see. But <laughs> And I selected for myself another huge project, another huge spread. You know that I color here with colored pencils without addition of watercolors. So it's time consuming project. Here I have beautiful Scotland legend about fin folk, sea creatures. And I started to work on the right side next. Of course, I intend to color the rest of it. I don't have any problems here with color choices. I can imagine everything here. I just need time and I need to give my hand a little bit of rest from time to time because sometimes I feel that it's tired after doing the whole background with pencils. So that's my big plan for Rosanna's book to finish this legend, this Scottish story, in December. Next, I have one printed picture, of course it's from Tatiana Bagema book. I currently have small problems with printing something, but quite fortunately I printed this one a year ago, I didn't have time to color it, and now I have it, so I will do it. And it's one of my favorite pictures in Tatiana Bagema Christmas books. I don't remember now from which one it exactly like Christmas Village or from any other of her books, but of course when I will post when I post video I will put the name of the book so you can color together with me. I do love that here we have a lot of various things. Nice interior design. We can practice how to color fire, stone, wood, all those beautiful pine tree garlands, Christmas decorations, and of course look at this very cute cooking elf and his friend Snowman. So that's definitely it's in my coloring December plans. Even when I look at this page, maybe I can start to feel a little bit of Christmas spirit. Next, I hope that this December will be a nice a moment for me to finally start this beautiful book, which I already own for a very long time. But I always so afraid to start doing something here. It's unusual paper for me, unusual style. And for December I want to do at least one of these beautiful angels. Look at this spread. Sorry again for the lightning, you know that here we have some big problems with electric lights, so I try to use some lanterns, uh, desktop lamps, but I know that light in my videos is far from perfect. Anyway, I hope that you can see details of this very elegant angels. I don't know which one I love more. And here my only problem is what to do with the background. For now I opt for a quite simple one color um, plain matte background, which I can do either with acrylic or with gouache paint. I think that when we have such a detailed image, um, something very natural and very light like pastel purple or pastel blue or vice versa, something quite dark, like dark blue or dark green, can work quite well and to create beautiful contrast to all those traditional green, red, gold, which we need to use for the garlands, for the angels, musical instruments. So I hope that this December will help me to find courage finally to color something in this beauty. Next. 
Of course, Teresa Goodrich. Who can spend December without pictures in Teresa Goodrich books? Enchanted Christmas I love a little bit less comparing to the Christmas charm. So here I definitely will do one. I think that I will do this one. And then I definitely will do a page with unicorn. Sorry guys, I somehow lost my... I was sure that I put... That's another one which I want to do. I don't know, but I really love the face of the um, elf. But my first choice here will be with unicorn, because I promised to color it. This one. It's partly fairy tale, partly winter picture, so I think that it could be quite nice. I just have to think uh, what to do with the uh, walls of the castle. Do I want to make it colorful or it will be enough to add a little bit of uh, highlights, uh, maybe with yellow. And the rest of this page I think that I will color without problems. I hope that it will look very nice and similar to children's illustrations. Next, I have my symphony of cute animals, where each month I try to color at least one page, but for December I can't choose which one I want to do. Unfortunately, both are spread, and even with the smaller size of this book, I am sure that they will require a lot of time. This one is beautiful and quite elegant for my taste, but I am a little bit afraid with all this empty background. If I want to do it with pencils, well, I guess that I need to start it immediately and maybe I will finish until the uh, Christmas day. The second one, it's even more detailed. I don't know, maybe I can color this one in January. It's not so... Yeah, it's Christmas with all those trees and other things, but it also has a lot of nice uh, Animals very cute. I especially love these penguins and look at this adorable seal probably. I hope you can see him. So <laughs> I can't make final decision which one to color and I imagine that both will be quite complicated and long colorings. But I do enjoy working in Kanoko Higusa books. Even if here I still struggle with paper and Maybe in my next projects I will do with Prisma colors. Still, I feel that it's a little bit more difficult, more complicated to blend on this paper comparing to paper in my Japanese editions of um, Rhapsody and Manoid. But that's definitely not a reason to postpone doing one of these beautiful pictures. Next, another crazy detailed picture which I Selected for myself in my Clara Markova book. Again, you can see that you can spend the whole month doing this one. Again, I do love that we have various things, so you never will be bored. You can do one part of it with Christmas tree and presents. The next day you can do the fireplace and all those beautiful things standing on it. And then you can finish all those cookies. So really very nice, very cute, very <laughs> festive looking, but very detailed and definitely not a very quick coloring. Next I have another beautiful winter picture in Halub Kovanki. You know that it's a book where I absolutely enjoy to color with polychromous pencils, very meditative pleasure. Um, and I think that I can do this one maybe with a little bit of watercolor for the background, or maybe I can do the whole page with pencils. It's relatively small and I do love that it has again various elements. Christmas tree, candle, you can do it with dark or with a snow background. And of course, when I see Cardinal bird, I immediately want to color such page. I have a soft spot for these birds. I never saw them in real life, obviously, they are, um, they are not living in our area, but on pictures they are so unusual, adorable. So I absolutely love all pictures where I can find them. Next, 
In November I hadn't started my new Apple book, so maybe December will be more lucky time. And here uh, we have beautiful winter pictures with Christmas trees, with uh, Christmas uh, interiors, but as a first page I would be afraid to select such a complicated picture. So maybe I can try something more natural, because it's not the best, not the worst page here. Nice, but definitely I won't be so intimidated by this page. And I imagine that to turn it into winter picture I can simply uh, change a little bit the landscape uh, behind the window. Maybe um, I can do a dark night with some highlights, maybe buildings with uh, bright windows, maybe Christmas tree. So go sitting at home, she is looking at the, uh, I don't know, maybe central square of her town where they started to create Christmas tree. I hope that I will manage to turn it into a perfect winter picture and in such a way I can test paper, I can get accustomed, I can select which pencils work better here and I hope that it will be a start of a very a long and pleasant journey in this book. Well, let me put this pile aside. Because it's still not the end. The whole December I will try to color as many pictures as possible in my two main December books. Christmas Charm, which for now is my favorite there is a good rich Christmas book and I want to color here everything so I think that I can simply open it on the random random picture uh, and that will be my coloring plan to, just to color as many pictures as possible and I do love that here we have the biggest variety of them we have interior designs, we have some verses, the Christmas compositions, we have beautiful views of Christmas villages, with churches, with shops. So you again never would be bored even if you color just one book the whole month. I hope that my Prisma colors pencils, which are my main media for this book, they will <laughs> they will keep you know, for all my coloring plans for this book. I have problem with light blue colors. Anyway, my second book will be this newest adorable addition to my coloring book collection. I specifically wanted this one because here pictures they are small and even if paper is thin, book is one-sided so you can easily color part of it with felty pens with markers and for such style of pictures I think that you can even skip all those shading, gradients, the only thing is to make something festive and bright. And I don't know also how I intend to color here, maybe starting from the first and moving in order, because here I equally love all pictures, they all are very nice. Well, that was all about winter and Christmas. But that's not about all my plans, because I promised my patrons to do two pictures in mythographic book, books. It will be a nice um, switch between winter Christmas theme and something else. So I have paradise and here my patron selected this beauty with eastern dragon and I especially interested in calling this Japanese lady really nice. And my other patron wanted to color page from Voyage and I agree with her that it's a little bit intimidating book. And she selected extremely complicated page with koi carbs, but you know that I love challenges. I do just need to decide where I can start to resolve this puzzle because we have here many layers. On the top layer of the water we have those lotus flowers, then we have actually water, we have uh, this tiny person sitting on the edge of the leaf, then we have uh, several layers beneath the water, 
koi cars, turtle, then kind of railway station. So complicated, but as I said, I love this series of the books and it's a perfect moment finally to start using my Voyage. You know that in the beginning of December there will be a new book by Alexandra Fusi, I believe, but <laughs> when I hear about new book in mythographic series I always want it, so maybe I need to color more in these books in order to justify for myself why I need new books if I have so many unstarted books in this collection. I already mentioned in my previous videos that in January I want to do a marathon through all the mythographic books, so I hope that I can start it early in December, but by doing these two pictures which I promised to my patrons. And finally, if I need more distraction from Christmas, Sam, you know that sometimes you do many winter and Christmas pictures and you start to feel overwhelmed. So I will put near my working table these three books. Here we have this adorable cat coloring book. Here I don't want to do Christmas page. I am more interested in all those pictures with cafe, restaurant, cats cooking something and my first choice is this beautiful bakery. And I also will try to con continue coloring with markers. I was quite pleased with my November experience when I did pictures with markers and pencils in Dark Beauty and in Goddesses. So in Goddesses I think about, not Leia, but again from Greek mythology about Hebe. She is beautiful and around we have a lot of interesting botanical details. Definitely not a winter picture, but sometimes it's nice to change subject of your coloring. And in Dark Beauty I selected one very beautiful but definitely cruel lady. I want to do this one. I already can imagine all colors. I think that she will be in green dress and some golden decorations maybe on the sleeves, definitely on the um, jewelry, but I haven't decided yet regarding her skin. Will she be with fair skin or maybe I can also do something unusual like golden skin. It would be interesting to try. So I hope that one day when I won't be in the mood for Christmas pictures I will do something here. Well, that's were my huge plans. I know that I need 60 days in December or something with time traveling, but I hope that at least part of these pictures will move from my coloring plans into my coloring summary of December finished pictures. Thank you and I hope that you also have a lot of beautiful Christmas books and you have better Christmas spirit comparing to myself but I hope that my spirit will arrive soon. Thank you and until the next videos, until the next Christmas pictures.